Hi Libra and welcome to my channel. This reading is going to focus on you and your person. So this is for those of you in separation from someone that could be your soulmate or twin flame. Although this is dated September 2022, this reading is timeless and could resonate whenever you come across this reading. Remember it's general though and won't resonate with all of you. Take the parts that resonate and leave the rest. It's obviously not personal. Um, so I want to look into the energy of your connection first of all. Quite a few cards have come out here. Wow, so right in the middle we've got broken heart. And I've got to say, um, as I was shuffling, I was feeling quite a tightness over the heart chakra. So some heartbreak for some of you, or this could be your person, because this is the connection. I feel for some of you this is heartbreak, you know, because you're missing each other. Um, energetically, you know, you might not actually constantly be yearning or missing this person, but your heart is pulled to each other. Um, if you're twin flames, you're very connected through the heart chakra. So it's common to experience heart pulls, heart sensations. But there could also be a relationship here that you're in or your person's in and there's some heartbreak and maybe a breakup. Things have been a bit tumultuous. Um, harsh words shared. Now this doesn't just have to be a love relationship. Some of you might find you've been tested recently with connections in your life, family, friends, work colleagues. I certainly feel your person has. Um, they're going through a shift here. I feel heart chakra opening. It's actually coming through here. And for some of you, this is also like inner conflict you're experiencing in terms of this connection. Um, like your mind is, or the, the ego, you know, there's a voice in your head, that's what they're, they're showing me, um, that's making you feel broken hearted. So maybe. For some of you, you're letting doubt creep in. You're seeing signs that are maybe making you feel very doubtful. Um, or you're seeing something online in relation to your person. Um, you know, if they're in a relationship. That's for some of you. Now you could be picking up on your person's energy as well. This is quite common. Um, and that's what's causing this anxiety for some of you. Fighting energies off. I really do feel that conflict um, here within some of you. Um, so we've got a chakra, third chakra, solar plexus. Yeah, so some healing is happening um, in this connection. You might really be feeling a pull in the solar plexus as well, as well as the heart chakra at this time. And this is as your person is going through this shift energetically. As they start to heal and sort of open up, 
they feel this pull to you even more. You might have experienced stomach issues recently, or your person might have done. Um, Archangel Chamuel is helping you and your person in terms of driving forward and finding the motivation to do this, to come out of this hostile energy for some of you or your person. We've got patience, so some of you have been impatient as well, um, wondering when things are going to change, but divine timing is at play, so things will shift at the right time. You wouldn't want to both come together when you're in that energy. Okay, so healing is needed here, it would seem. You are protected, being guided. We've got the number of the tower, 16. So tower moments happening for some of you or um, maybe for your person. Especially in relation to connections. I feel. You've both got the angel of love around you, helping you both to open your heart to this love, to this connection. You know, this is bringing love into your life as well. And um, could be that, you know, some soul connection, soul family come into your life. So if you've been drawing those connections in. Okay, so let's um, tune into your person's energy. Wow, that's interesting. We got the tower that's come out. 16, 16. Um, and I also noticed temperance, 14, which is the number of this card, 14, 14. So some of you might be seeing those numbers or your person might be becoming aware of number synchronicities. Um, this can also be signs between you both like telepathy through numbers. Yeah, we've got two threes, so definitely got a karmic situation here coming through. Something that's not working out is the three of pentacles reversed. Your person put has put in a lot of effort. Um but with three of swords reversed, it's like I mean, we've got broken heart there. It's the same sort of energy, um, heartbreak. It's not over yet, I feel, in that connection. There's a positive shift with it being reversed. And with justice, this is showing um, the scales of justice in that connection that they're in. Um, your energy here, Libra. Libra Sagittarius is coming out strongly here. Potentially a divorce, something legal here. So your person is needing to heal, find moderation and balance and be patient. She came out there. Um, so yeah, with the tower King of Wands reversed. Your person's energy's off. I mean, that's really what I'm feeling. There's, there's healing here needed. Something quite major that they're going through with 
three major arcana. Um, so this is showing a very spiritual connection. Something here they're being guided to let go of. Um, I feel your person hasn't really known what they wanted. Very sort of distorted energy. So either that was how they were with you, the king of ones reversed, or this is where they're at that brings this shift with the tower. Awakening energy here. Something that wasn't built on solid ground, which we're seeing here. Three of Pentacles reversed. To feel your person rushed into something. This could even be a job, by the way. It doesn't have to just be a relationship. And obviously, if, if you rush into something like that and don't build it on solid ground, the tower happens, it crumbles. Wow, there's another three at the bottom of the deck. Three, three, three. So you might be seeing that number a lot. Yeah, your person's very focused on career at the moment. On their work. If they work for themselves, they could work for themselves. But it's like they're also looking out there at other options in that area. Um, in terms of love, we've got a single energy here. So they could be single at the moment or sort of, you know, that's, that's happening, let's say. Um, okay, so Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Libra. They're just telling me this broken heart hasn't happened yet for some. Okay, when this turns up right, this is clearly for your person. So there's definitely some discord there. Yeah, I'm getting emotions here coming through for your person. I'm definitely feeling a blocked heart chakra for your person. They've held on to a lot of emotions there um not just from it seems from their past they haven't processed but also if they're in a situation this hostilities it's like it's bubbling up to the surface and then with a the tower it just explodes one day that's the energy i'm feeling you know like a storm it's interesting we had a, a storm here um, thunder and lightning yesterday here in the UK so I was thinking that I thought I wonder if this is relevant you know to some in the collective okay so we're looking at your energy now then Libra So we've got another three, a lot of threes in this reading, um, which is showing alignment with spirit, you know, body, mind, spirit, and with this person, it's starting to happen. Um, some of you, yeah, you've come out of an unfulfilled energy, you're starting to feel better in yourself, maybe you're connecting with friends and family at this time. Uh, in terms of finances, um, some of you might be thinking of making a change there in your work. You don't feel you're getting what you deserve. You've got death reverse, so some of you are going through a transformation as well. It's quite interesting. 
mirroring in this reading. Um, it's a gradual process. We've got um, two fours there, so angels are around you, protecting you and this connection. Four of wands, twin flame energy, definitely, I'm feeling this reading. Um, two cards here of union, so this is on your mind for some of you, or for some of you this could be coming in, because it's in your energy. This person feels a lot of regret, feeling that's their energy. If they come towards you, that's the energy they're going to be in. Some of you though, as well, um, if you're in a relationship, you've, you've, you're feeling some regret over something, um, over a loss. I mean, it could be the loss of your person, obviously with a heartbreak that came up before. Um, but for some of you, you might have been in a, a sort of unfulfilling work situation is really coming through. Um, or someone in your social circle. It could be karmic, yeah, I'm getting a karmic energy for you as well. So Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Scorpio. Okay, let's clarify the tower for your person. Yeah, a massive shift with judgment as well. For some of them, this is around their sole purpose, um, making a decision, seeing things differently, wanting something else, wanting more. So huge awakening, these two, um, first of all. They want something new. This can also be, you know, new partnership after a renewal period, healing, this can be um, reconciliation, reunion, which we're seeing here for you. Wow, okay, this has fallen on the Three of Cups. Magician reversed, wow. So, Spirit's saying now is not the right time. That's why we've got patience, yeah. <laughs> um, because the magician is a very powerful energy. You've got the infinity symbol there. Definitely feeling twin flames. You've been trying to manifest, you know, this energy, reunion. Yeah, and spirit saying, not yet. Okay, as I said, it's all because of the energy, so it's for your highest good. Quite interesting how that came out. Um, okay, another two has come out here. Yeah, see again your person's energy we're seeing is off, off balance, that's what I was feeling. Um, the wounded warrior. But they're very much focused on the past. So here's that regret I was feeling coming through for this person, and they want a fresh start in their life. They want to take a leap of faith, but they've got the other things to be dealing with here, first of all. Yeah, could, this can show the end of a relationship they're going through, um, moving on from that. Your person realises where they've lied to themselves in that situation. It wasn't aligned. And here again is the regret coming through. Well, I'm feeling a lot of guilt here in my energy. Um, you know, your person here with the fish, you know, they want to extend that apology and reach out. 
but as we're getting, it's not the right time. So let's clarify for you death reversed. So first of all, the Eight of Cups reversed, yeah. Something here that some of you haven't released and moved on from. Um, this is all about spiritual growth, you know, walking up that mountain to enlightenment, growing spiritually, overcoming obstacles, but that's reversed, so there's something here in the way. Yeah, like no forward movement here. I feel for some of you, this is your in your mind. There's, a, there's some negativity coming through. Um, maybe a blocked heart chakra for you as well here, Libra. And not taking action in your life in some area. And this does link to finances. Some of you might, as I said, you feel that you're not receiving what you deserve things aren't moving forward and the reason spirit showing you is this energy you need to come out of that with it being reversed um, maybe there's an addiction codependency very attached to this person and the outcome which you're seeing here and there's focused on the past there coming out, that needs to be released for anything to shift, yeah. Lack of finance is definitely coming through. For some of you, yeah, you've been sort of hoarding, maybe, you know, really watching your pennies, but this is also abandonment issues for some of you that you need to look at here and that it's not helping you move on, move forward in your life. Wow, okay, that was quite deep, Libra. Um, so it really does seem it's stagnant at the moment in this energy that's coming through. Um, so, you know, take what you will from that. Let's pull some whispers of love as well. telling me this is messages from your higher self and your person's higher self. So from your person, wow, I love you. That's what your person's higher self wants to say to you. That's beautiful. And you might, you know, if you see that, message you know on a on something after this reading that's a sign for you that that's from your person wow i'm really feeling emotions in this reading libra and you know you might walk past a shop and you see that on, on a mug they're telling me on a teddy bear on a doll on a plaque They're showing me like a badge as well. Okay, some of you might even be drawn to buy that item. Okay, so from you, the only thing that is real is love. Shift your focus back to love. Yeah, so you're, help, you're telling your person to heal that broken heart that's coming out there um, and to focus on true love, this connection that you feel 
Um, your person does in the 5D, clearly, but in the 3D it's very different, as we're seeing here. Yeah, we've got seven there, very spiritual connection again coming through. Okay, Libra, I hope you've enjoyed this reading. Please do leave a comment, hit the like button, subscribe if so. Sending peace, love and light to you all.